Okay, so this episode will be really weird. I had to record um, this next um, quest in two parts. So hopefully it looks a little better on your end, but we'll get through this. Um, I don't know why it did that. No idea. But yeah. Do you recall the story of Act 2, Scene 1? Blaming Prince Hamlet's madness on the broken heart is one explanation. Of course, the dastard Polonius likely has his own reasons for claiming such. Hamlet is not crazy. But Aaron, you know that Prince Hamlet is not truly mad. It is but an act, understand? So we are starting Act 2, Scene 2, yay, and I believe this is called The Prince's Madness, I'm not really sure, I think it might be, maybe, I'll have to look, but you will definitely know in the title of the video, oh no, Rosencrantz and Guildenstern, that's what this one's called. Rosencrantz and Guildenstern. Funky names. <laughs> Welcome, dear Rosencrantz and Guildenstern. The need we have to use you did prove. Ascending, transform, so called. I entrust you both at being. So basically, they want those two to go and talk to Hamlet to see if he truly is mad or why he is mad. I have a daughter. He's talking about the letter that Hamlet wrote to Ophelia. Doubt though the stars are fire, doubt truth be a liar, but never doubt I love Ophelia. Oh dear Ophelia, I am ill at these numbers. Text is so fast. Damn you, text. Hmm. So basically he told the king that Hamlet is going crazy and he should do something. <laughs> tis a ghost or not, I believe in that which I see, surely tis superstition, and yet I've not found rest since I've heard of this ghost. Could there be some substance to this myth? But what if it's true? Ask about, we'll ask about Prince Hamlet. Oh, a ghost, a ghost has appeared. Oh snap.
What are you? Are you? <laughs> Fail. Wow. I don't think all the dexterity in the world could help me. Seriously. Oh, well, that was better. I got them skills. Or not, you know. Oh my god, run. Run, 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 run. Oh, jeez. All the ghosts have been defeated. Let us talk to the NPC. What is this all about? A ghost? Who in the day believes in ghosts? Who in this day believes? Prince Hamlet? I saw him going towards the room to the north. Do, do, do. All right. So I gotta pull up the other one real quick. Pause it. Do, do, do. Yeah. So yeah. Like I said, this will be a really odd video. Here we go. Continuation. Because I'm too lazy to edit. Because that's how I roll. Like a dinner roll. Man, I'm hungry. For once have these rats come. Tis bad enough these base rumors spread about. I can't even clean up. We'll ask about Hamlet again. Vile rats, I'll get each of you yet. Invisible rats? What? Oh, no one. <laughs> Fat rat! Die! These are some huge OB rats. Like, like, friggin' I don't even know. Shoot it! for the help. Prince Hamlet should be in the reception room. I don't know where that is. No idea. My lord. Excellent good friends. How do you both? This guy looks crazy. Why are you here? To visit you, my lord, no other occasion. In finding you, Aaron was a measurable help. Because nobody else knows how to do anything. And my lord, that you must teach me, but let me conjure you. We were sent for. I will tell you why.
confess their guilt. I will have them reenact the murder of my father in front of my uncle. The play will reveal the king's guilt. Awaited thee. If thou verified the Alon relic, thou must have seen how unjust I have been treated. It felt my duty to warn the impending doom. Put the warnings into my works. What the gods truly fear is my ability to foretell the future. I predicted the disasters that the gods would unleash on the Partholonians and warn the people. For my actions, I spent many days locked in Avon. All my writings thus far have been destroyed by the gods, but I will somehow complete Hamlet. Iron, I need thy strength. Thou must understand the strength hidden within thee. Oh, sleep. Tis he, the Grim Reaper. Prison guard of Avon. He seeks my life. Oh, kick his butt. Nobody messes with my Shakespeare. Mm -mm, not a one. The Grim Reaper is fearsome. I can beat him with my little elfin fail archery skills. You watch. I'll pwn him. Oh, yeah. And what? Oh god. Oh god. Or not. Hey, potion. Oh, he. Oh. No! Oh my god. Tis no good that thou art too weak to face the Grim Reaper. I will let thee escape to Avon. No, what about Shakespeare? I feel like such a failure. <laughs> Yay! He escaped! Ha ha! In your face, Reaper. You should not have believed me. I love you not. I was the more deceived. Why wouldst thou be the breeder of sinners? I am myself indifferent. I am very proud, revengeful, ambitious, and more offense at my back. Go thy way to a nunnery. Oh, what a noble mind is here overthrown, and I, lady most defect, deject, and wretched. So I'll try to explain a little more of the fast text goings on in this scene um, in the description at the bottom. Um, as for the next episode, just click the annotation in the top right and I will see you soon for the next episode. Thanks.